हेलो व्यूवर्स वेलकम बैक होप यू ऑल आर फाइन टुडे आई विल टेल यू अबाउट क्रोकोडाइल अ क्रोकोडाइल इज़ अ रेप्टाइल दैट कैन लेव टू आवर अ हंड्रेड ईयर्स ओल्ड एक्सप्लोर द लेवस ऑफ क्रोकोडाइल्स विद दिस हैंडी गाइड फॉर एजुकेटर्स क्रोकोडाइल्स आर वन ऑफ द मोस्ट क्रिसमेटिक एनिमल्स क्रोकोडाइल्स आर रेप्टाइल्स कार्निवोरस प्रिडेटर्स एंड आर नाट फूसी दे विल ईट वट एवर इज अवेलेबल इन देयर हैबिटाट दैट इज़ वन ऑफ द रीजनस दे हैव नाट हैड टू एडोप्ट एंड चेंज मच ओवर द लास्ट फिफ्टी मिलियन ईयर्स दो शेयरिंग quite a lot of similarities in their appearance morphology crocodiles alligators and gharials belong to different families semens belong to the same family as alligators gharial have a very narrow snout alligators have a u shaped snout and a pronounced or white crocodiles have a v shaped snout and a longer head they do not have an overbite but they do have a large fourth tooth which can be seen even when their mouth is shut this is a really reliable characteristics for identification all of these semi aquatic reptiles belong to a huge order called crocodilia crocodiles separated from other crocodilians around 50 million years ago during the ocean life is originated and to categories by scientists in order to determine how living organisms are related the system or organization is called taxonomy Crocodilia is one example of an order primates is another example Do you know the closest living relatives of crocodilians are birds that is right birds and crocodilians evolved from members of a group called archosaurs dinosaurs crocodiles are predatory reptiles which have adapted to a semi aquatic lifestyle crocodiles are reptiles which means they lay eggs they can tuck their feet into the sides of their steam lined bodies while they swim to reduce water resistance and build speed they propel themselves through the water at speeds of up to 18 mile per hour this helps them to quickly catch prey in short yes a crocodile is a reptile crocodiles are classified as semi aquatic reptiles meaning that they live both in and out of water Crocodiles can be found throughout the tropics in Africa, Asia, the Americas and Australia. In fact, reptiles can be found on every continent in the world apart from Antarctica. Reptiles are cold-blooded vertebrates that are closely linked to amphibians. Reptiles actually evolved from ancestral amphibians around 340 million years ago. When we hear the word cold-blooded, we often think of animals being icy cold. However, this is not actually the case. If an animal is cold-blooded, they are unable to maintain a constant body temperature. therefore they need to seek out sunlight to keep their body heat up this is why you will often see crocodiles lying out in the sun for longer periods of time 
Being cold-blooded also means that reptiles like crocodiles are not able to burn as much energy keeping themselves warm. This means that they end up eating much less food than a mammal of their size or a similar sized warm-blooded animal. So a crocodile is a reptile but they are not alone in this group. There are ton of different types of reptiles which generally fit into these main categories. Snakes, crocodiles and alligators, turtles and lizards. One of the key features of crocodiles behavior is that they are largely nocturnal animals. Crocodiles are predators. Crocodiles can also travel distances of several miles over land because they are only semi-aquatic. Thanks for watching. Take care.